ladies and gentlemen. Tonight, we are happy to welcome back to the telephone hour, Renato Tebaldi, noted soprano, who appears with Donald Voorhees and the Bell Telephone Chorus and Orchestra. With Thanksgiving but a few days away, our thoughts turn homeward. For Thanksgiving is the time of going home, of bringing the family together, and of giving thanks for the bounty of our land and the rich heritage of its people. A story that typifies this spirit as much today as when it was written over 300 years ago is Kremser's famous prayer of thanksgiving, which the chorus sings for us now. Our guest artist, Renata Tebalde, midway between her operatic triumphs in San Francisco and Chicago and her return to Italy. But we're happy to say that she'll be back in this country in January to appear at the Met. For her opening selection, she brings us an aria she sang on her first telephone hour appearance, Puccini's lovely Un Bel Di, One Fine Day, from Madame Butterfly. Miss Tebalde.
remember what Thanksgiving was like when you were a youngster? The family would all gather together at Grandmother's house. You play outside in the yard while Mother disappeared into the bustle and flurry of the kitchen, and Father joined the men in the parlor to talk of important things. Then the Thanksgiving dinner, and your eyes growing rounder as they took in the big dining room table, now covered in gleaming white and groaning with mountains of mashed potatoes, steaming giblet gravy, a shimmering mound of cranberry jelly, grandmother's cream chestnut, your favorite dish, and at the head of the table, the turkey, brown and crisp and bursting with rich, fragrant dressing. Grandmother, flushed and smiling, would tell everyone where they were supposed to sit. Grandfather would clear his throat, and you'd all lower your head as he pronounced grace. Reynata Tabalde offers next a romantic Spanish piece by Joaquin Turina. Again accompanied by Donald Voorhees and the Bell Telephone Orchestra, Mr. Tabalde sings Cantare. by Jan Sibelius has become universally accepted as a composition that makes everyone think of his homeland. And at this time of year, it is only natural for our minds and hearts to travel in that direction. Donald Voorhees now conducts the Bell Telephone Orchestra and Chorus in the Stirring Finlandia by Sibelius.
Peter Tribaldi, joined by the Bell Telephone Chorus and Orchestra under the direction of Donald Voorhees, brings our program to a close with the majestic Inflamatus from Rossini's Sabbat Mater.
This team is Madame Butterfly, Turinas Cantares, and with the chorus, the Informatus Norsini Sabat Mater. The chorus is heard in Prenz's Prayer of Thanksgiving and with the orchestra in Finlandia by Sibelius. Next week at this time, our guest artist will be the celebrated pianist Clifford Curzon. On December 3rd, you will hear the young soprano of the Met, Lucine O'Mara. On the 10th, Brian Sullivan will star, and on the 17th, we will present Robert Cassidasis. If you would like to attend our programs, all of which originate in Carnegie Hall, send your request to the telephone hour, Box 404, New York, 19, New York, and we will send you tickets. That's Box 404, New York, 19, New York. Television viewers will be interested in the program Our Mr. Sun later this evening on another network. Presented by the Bell Telephone System, Our Mr. Sun is the first of a new science series. We suggest you consult your newspaper for time and station. Be sure to join the telephone hour next Monday when Clifford Curzon plays the finale of the concerto in A minor by Grieg with Donald Voorhees and the Bell Telephone Orchestra. Until then, we remain sincerely yours the Bell Telephone System, reminding you that someone somewhere would enjoy hearing your voice by telephone tonight. 